what's the one thing that you would want to share with a senior leader to say, this is the thing that you need to know to be successful? I think probably be the one thing is if that's something in your life that you struggle with, whether that's worry piece, anxiety is usually mixed in, fears mixed in, it's kind of all one big disaster, but figure out how you can have systems in your life, processes in your life, tools that you can lean into, people you can lean into that help pull you out of that, because that's usually going to make the season longer that you're in. And you're going to have a lot more challenge with some relationships, probably likely you're not going to show up your best because you're emotionally pretty tapped. And so I'm just saying all these things out of experience. And I have a lot of different things I do to help through those seasons. Fight for perspective would be the one thing. And that works differently for lots of people. I mean, sometimes for me, it's go for a run and listen to music. Sometimes it's have a conversation and just unload everything. Sometimes it's journaling. There's lots of different things. And I feel like it, in different seasons, it's different things. But I would say overall, it's that fighting for perspective of maybe what's actually going on. I think in business, I would say the perspective being most of us hear the news, read the articles, all those things. And oftentimes the only things that are highlighted are kind of things that make you scared because those yep. are usually what sell. And so pulling away from those types of things is helpful. But again, it's just fighting for a perspective of like reality of what's going on in your own life and then fixing it. And so it could be we're burning too much from an expense standpoint. We need to cut some staff or expenses and you just got to do it. Like don't think about it a ton and don't take your emotion out of it. If it's people, you're still changing someone's life a little bit. But again, back to just fight for perspective because that usually helps. It's why I have a sign over my door that says what matters in 20 years because usually that brings perspective of like, oh my word, I still have an incredible life. We live in a great house. We have an incredible community. I've got great kids. But I think that usually helps ground or root me in that right kind of scenario.